Introducing the new Blue Cat Audio MB5 Dynamics plugin. The MB5 is an extremely versatile 1 to 5 band multi band dynamics processor. It can be used for compression, limiting, gating, expansion, or wave shaping. MB5 also has unique envelope detection capabilities that lets one band trigger the dynamics response of other selected bands. Add in the rich visual frequency and amplitude feedback, along with the streamlined user interface and exceptional sound quality, and all of this makes the MB5 a great addition to anyone's audio toolkit. So let's go over the different sections of the plugin. At the top, we have overall level control as well as the main toolbar. These tools allow the user to customize the look and layout of the plugin with the ability to show or hide different sections of the user interface. The graph and control areas can be toggled on or off, letting the user decide how best to use the plugin for their workflow. There is a lock icon that keeps the current user interface view when changing presets, and a zoom tool for resizing the plugin window. The link icon links all of the individual band's controls together. Help and info icons allow for quick access to information about the plugin. And there is a dedicated section for preset selection and creation. The next section is the main graph display. This gives the user not only a quick way to adjust the output and crossover frequencies of the plugin's separate bands, but there is a built-in spectrum analyzer showing the output of the affected audio. Several controls at the bottom of this section allow for changing the details of what is shown in this area. Spectrum graph contrast, DB range, graph type, channel selection, and show hide for plugin controls give the user control over the best settings for their individual workflow needs. The crossover area allows control over each band's crossover frequency and slope to be set individually. This area is populated depending on how many bands are active. This is also where you set how many bands are active in the plugin, from 1 broadband to 5. A great feature when switching to the lower number of bands is the ability not to lose the settings of the bands deactivated. Setting the number of bands higher again brings back the previous settings. There is also a setting to change the stereo instance of the plugin from operating between left, right, and mid side modes. The center of the interface is dedicated to the detail control of the current band. The top section switches between the bands and has access to the band preset menu. This also allows for copying and pasting settings between bands. The up section has the controls to create a compressor limiter or expander and the down section has controls to create a gate or upward compressor. A great feature of having both sections available in the same band allows for the ability to create custom dynamics effects for each band. There is even a preset menu for creating and recalling custom dynamics curves, as well as using factory presets as starting points. The peak RMS mode controls if the incoming signal is triggered off the peak transients or average loudness and allows to be blended between the two. Depending on how this control is set determines what time parameters are used. Peak detection uses the attack and release parameters, in addition to the hold parameter that lets the user specify how long the detector waits before it starts decreasing. The RMS envelope has a single RMS average parameter. If all of these parameters are set to zero, a wave shaper distortion unit is activated. Makeup gain compensates for the change in gain due to the dynamics process. For the stereo version of the plugin, there are multiple settings on how the two channels are linked and affected by one another, as well as bypassing the effector on either of the channels. A unique feature of the MB5 is the ability to use the source input, any of the individual band inputs, or an external sidechain input as the input level control for each band's envelope detection. This gives the user complete flexibility over how the dynamics envelopes are triggered. The monitoring section is an overview of the dynamics processing, along with a set of controls, threshold sliders, and level meters for each band. Either clicking on the band numbers at the top of the section, or the threshold sliders will select the controls for that band. There are bypass, mute, and solo controls for each band, for completely bypassing the effect, muting, or soloing a particular band. Level meters for each band show both input and output level per band, as well as showing the amount of compression or expansion. Each band also has a link toggle to set that band into a linked state. The R icon sets the band into a reverse linked state. 
if a band is not active, the controls are grayed out. The Mix and Limit Output section control the overall final output of the plugin by adjusting the wet dry output mix and engaging and controlling the output limiter. Finally, on the left and right sides of the plugin are the input and output meters. The output meter also has the gain reduction meter for the output limiter. With a detailed but simple to use interface and exceptional sound quality, the MB5 Dynamics plugin is an extremely powerful all in one processor. With rich visual feedback from the Spectrum Analyzer, quick access to all of the controls for sculpting the Dynamics response of any type of source audio, and the ease of creating and recalling not only overall presets, but presets for the type of processing and even the processing curve, make the MB5 a first choice plugin for any type of Dynamics processing situation. MB5 is available for Mac and Windows in AAX, AU, and VST plugin formats. For more information on MB5 or any of the great range of Blue Cat Audio plugins, go to www.bluecataudio.com.